Hello friends, welcome back to my another After Effects tutorial, in this tutorial we are going to see how to make zoom rotation transition in After Effects, you can see the effects preview playing in the background, you can download all my animation preset pack and project files for free from my store, the store link is given in the description. Now let's jump into After Effects and start creating it. Here I have already added my two media files to the timeline, and I have placed them one after the other. So now let's create our zoom rotation transition effects. Now let's create a new adjustment layer. Now in effects and preset search for the transform. Add this transform effect to the adjustment layer. Now to create zoom effect we need to scale the image. Let's first scale the image. Now go to 10 frames. Create a keyframe for scale, do not change the scale value. Now go to 1 second. Now change the scale value to 300. Now go at 1 second and 20 frames. Change the scale value to 100. Now let's see the preview. Now press U to view created keyframes. Now select all created keyframes. Change keyframe assistant to easy ease. Now slightly adjust the speed graph as shown. Now come back to 10 frames. Create a keyframe for rotation. Now go to 1 second and 20 frames. Change the rotation value to minus 1. This value will set the rotation in clockwise or anti-clockwise, depending on your value the rotation direction will be set. You can see the preview. Now let's adjust the speed of the animation. Press U to view rotation keyframes. Select Rotation Keyframes. Change Keyframe Assistant to Easy Ease. Now slightly adjust the speed graph as shown. Now you can see the preview. Perfect. Now in effects and preset search for optical compensation. Now add it to the adjustment layer. Now come back to 10 frames. Create a keyframe for the field of view. Go to 20 frames. Change field of view value to 100. Now go to 1 second and 10 frames. Press U to view created keyframes. Create another keyframe for the field of view. Go to 20 frames. Change field of view value to 0. Make sure you have selected the reverse lens distortion. Change the field of view orientation to vertical. Now select all created keyframes. Change keyframe assistant to easy ease. Now adjust the speed graph as shown. Now you can see the preview. Here our animation is complete. You can increase or decrease the animation speed. To increase or decrease the animation speed you need to adjust the position of start and end keyframes. If you want to know how you can save this effects as your preset, watch my previous tutorial or watch the tutorial shown in the upper right corner. This is all for this tutorial. If you like this zoom rotation transition effect then don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, and if you want more similar transition tutorial let me know in the comment section. Or you can contact me on any of the social media platforms. And that is for this tutorial, see you on Friday with another tutorial. 
Thank you.